Jeff Rothorn for Get Out There Magazine. And I'm at Albion Hills Provincial <laughs> Park. And we are just starting the Albion Grind six hour race. The race took place at Albion Hills Conservation Area, which was Ontario's first conservation area and is in Caledon, Ontario, 45 minutes outside of Toronto. It boasts a variety of amenities, including mountain biking, camping, swimming, and 50 kilometers of trails to explore. The course is well marked and offers two aid stations along the route. So the course is um, primarily rolling single track. It's really pretty out here. And it's a uh, loop that's just under seven kilometers. And for the six hour, do as many loops as you can in that time provided. There's also a three hour, there's relay races and a half marathon. The race venue also offered events the day before on the Saturday, including the sport course and the enduro course. If you're thinking about adding any of these events to your race calendar for next year, keep in mind that these races are very popular and tend to sell out. So you should definitely register early to avoid disappointment. So here with Cynthia, we are on our seventh and final loop. That'll bring us just shy of 50 kilometers for the day. Unfortunately, we don't have time for an eighth loop. What do you think, Cynthia? I think we're good on seven. It's been a good day. Awesome weather. Great weather. Trails are in excellent condition. A lot of uh, nice single track. It's been a lot of fun. Good company. The volunteers were excellent and the race director did a great job of creating an Thanks upbeat atmosphere today. as he cheered on runners throughout Yay! the entire six hour race. Although this was my first Five Peaks event, I had been told that the swag at these events was always great right. and I certainly wasn't disappointed. Participants each received a pair of earbuds, which are perfect for running, a growler, which is a glass jug that can be filled with beer at many craft breweries, and a really cool tank top. This is Jeff Rothorn for Get Out There Magazine wishing you happy trails.